lovers welcome back to my youtube channel if you are new to the channel i am angel Munyai Kombokomba lavenda and um welcome just want to give you some updates i think it's been a while not posting man i think i have three i think two to three weeks not posting right i should say <laughs> i don't like that i'm not proud i don't want to lie i'm not proud and at the same time i don't want to beat myself up i don't want to be too hard on myself because i have reasons why i wasn't posting a lot of things have been happening at the same time and we were closing at work so obviously there was a lot of work for me to do and um and i feel like i'm not i didn't even finish my work i, I still feel bad that i didn't manage to finish my work i think even during this i will try to uh, to work if i can I just want to say that thank you so much for watching my videos and supporting me and everything um it really means a lot to me i listen not that this song is strict, I found if it wasn't for your support so which i really really appreciate and we go into 2023 man lovers i just want to share like a like a little story please don't mind my cats <laughs> so i just want to share how i used to celebrate christmas while i was growing up so uh, i spent a lot of my time in limpopo right so in limpopo we used to have this um group way by like it's young people each and every friday and saturday we would meet right and then we'd dance like different kind of dance that time we used to call it forgot the right name i wish i still have like videos and pictures old pictures because it was so nice i don't want to lie i feel like i can go back so we're in limpopo so i think that guy just wanted to take out to take kids out from the streets and then just to put them in one place so each and every friday and saturday we'll go there go dance it was so nice because each and every week we know that this is the place where we're going at right and we'll have trips to go to local area like local resorts it was so nice trust me so and we will watch like so each and every year during especially june 16 we will watch um sarafina so we used to even dance sarafina it was so nice trust me it was so nice i wish i wish we still have that but i think now nah we don't have that anymore so what we used to do is each and every year when it's december we'll go to like a local town which it was Toando. we were like um like these what's the thing it was like it was like skirts like right all of the skirts i think it was it was green and the other one it was it was pink so it <laughs> it was going with the levels and then we'll, you would wear with the white t-shirt we will go ask donations um we will have like a stem from the municipality and the police station and the local um i think about San. and we will go go ask for donation people will give us two rains the ones who will give us 10 rand and in a day if you have done like close to 100 or something like trust me or something you were called the best of the best and then what we will do with that money is we will buy food like we we'll buy grocery we cook and then on christmas day we meet we compete amongst each other we used to like our contest right there will be like miss Rukwarani. you model and then you become like first runner all those things it was so nice we'll get gifts <laughs> listen i wish my little sister and my niece and my nephews got to experience that because it was really nice imagine going out with other kids it was really nice i don't want to lie to you and then that tradition just started going uh, going down hey and um i wish i wish that thing still happens now because it was taking kids out of the streets trust me because each and every week on friday friday and saturday you make sure that you at the dance so you wake up in the morning you do your chores after doing your chores you bath then you go to the dance and then when it's six and then when it's five you need to go home you need to be at home before six and we stick to that to to that rule that a girl shouldn't be home after six you understand and it it, it, it will ground us. it was so good because they will tell us that before before 12 a girl child shouldn't go out shouldn't go play you understand and and, and it was so nice but I, I but it is what it is i guess time is moving then we came to the side we came to stay the side to my mother's side when we came to the side what they used to do the side is that each and every christmas what they do is they meet at um we meet at like my aunt's place or my uncle's place any any anybody and then we just have like a christmas party or christmas lunch each and every year we will do that because my granny have like 14 kids you know like so imagine how many cousins do i have so each and every year we will meet we will play do gift exchange with my cousins they like they will like 
my aunt used to buy us like gifts each and every year i wish we we kept that tradition but um that tradition just started going down i don't know how i don't know what happened and that was even before that was even before uh lockdown and i just didn't know why during new year's eve oh my gosh imagine all of us sitting there all of my cousins we will sit there at home having music we'll be dancing at that time we were not allowed to drink because we were still young right we didn't even care because we were playing games get us like cricket at 12 we know we're counting five four three and then the cricket trust me i really i really wish we can go back i don't want to lie i really wish we can but what i love is that last year is it from last year like their traditions started coming back we started having christmas lunch again which is nice i know that not everyone was around i was just so happy that we're doing this thing again but new year's eve we're no longer meeting up which is not a bad thing but yeah i wish we were doing that again but it is what it is honestly guys my phone is giving me some problems so i keep on the repeating same thing over and over again so which is it's fine um so what happened at last year is that i introduced a new new tradition so what we did is we did gift exchange right so each and every person you were getting like as an individual you were getting everyone in the house a gift we did gift exchange and it was so nice everyone was so happy everyone was looking forward to know oh my god what did i get what am i gonna get do you understand oh my god what you don't think that i mean and it was a good feeling i don't want to lie and it's something that we both want to get and what I love is that this year Mashudu introduced the tradition to her friends. So she's going to be doing gift exchange with her friends um, on Christmas. Because I'm not sure if we're going to be around in the morning. We're not going to be around in the morning. So I am really, trust me, I am really happy. And um, I'm really happy that we introduced this 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 uh, tradition. Because it's a good thing. Imagine. Ah, no. It, it even like... Um, we bond man during that time and we're creating memories so if you haven't started that tradition please i would advise you to start it you don't have to even buy like a, something big like last year my like little sister got me like an umbrella from pat which is like i was so happy because what is for my little sister i think this year we're gonna do happy new year gift exchange we're not gonna do christmas because not all of us are around this year which i'm sad but at the same time I'm just like listen as long as we're keeping the tradition if you want a cat please let me know because pal just gave birth to six kitties white all of them white so if you want a cat just text me tell me hey i need a cat angel so i want you to tell me there down below how you're gonna be celebrating your christmas this year and if you're getting anyone a gift because uh, trust me even if you just get like your mom like a chocolate or your loved one small things they do matter so love is next year 2023 we're moving and next year we're gonna be monetized so yeah that's what we that's what i'm working on and thank you so much for supporting me the whole year it really means a lot to me or like from the beginning it really means a lot to me and i am looking forward to grow with you so thank you so much thank you thank you so much i love you so much enjoy on christmas enjoy new year just enjoy from now on until until because it's never too late to say enjoy so and i love you so much i love us keep smiling show some gratitude and always be yourself cheers